last month I did a video, this is actually in early December, regarding Max Kaiser and his talk about Jesus, Bitcoins, Litecoins, and Quarks. And there were some other pundits talking about Quarks. And there was a lot of talk about cryptocurrencies at this time. You saw Bitcoins going to, I don't know, 1240-ish, more than the price of gold at that time. And I knew that something was wrong here. And what I raised concern about was this cryptocurrency quirk. I mentioned that, hey, you know what? This thing could go up, but I really didn't feel comfortable about it. And I always said that, you know what? Hey, I could be wrong and all that stuff. But my initial feeling was that quarks was not the copper you could say compared to copper like people compare bitcoins to gold litecoins to silver whatever even though it doesn't have the largest market cap out there litecoins does not have the second largest mar market cap right now i think it's ripples right now but we could check what was going on with quarks during that time frame when it comes to the price movements okay now we're at archive.org and let's just look at coinmarketcap.com which i typed below here and let's just look at the deal with quarks. All right, let's go to the year 2013, and um, let's look at December. It ha doesn't have records from earlier in the year in December. Excuse me, in January, February, March, April, but then it starts to have some data. And let's look at uh, December 2nd, the day after I did this video. Now, as you can see, this is highlighted. December 2nd, 2013. Now let's look at Quark coin, right? 20 cents. Okay. And it was down 17%. So it must have been higher the day before. It must have been like 20 some cents, 24, 25 cents around that range. So if you want to look at that, we have to see where is Quark coins right now? Okay, now let's look at where Quark Coins is at. Okay, it's at six cents. So one month later, Quark Coins is down how much percent? Over fifty percent, right? Fifty percent. Is it down seventy percent? Yeah, it's down seventy. Oh, close to seventy percent. So like sixty-five percent within a month and I raised suspicions uh, on that time during that time frame where certain pundits were talking about it now this doesn't mean that quarks is going to collapse I have, always have to say that because I could be wrong I always want to make that clear however when I saw what was going on in December something told me that it looked like this thing wasn't gonna go up it looked like there were a lot of individuals who got in early would make quite a bit of money but then those individuals who bought at the high end at like 20 cents or 25 cents those would lose out I remember this really well and I remember when you get all these moves going up and you have the media or alternative media get behind it I feel that going forward after the buy silver crash JP Morgan campaign that when there's a campaign like that that's a time where it could be potentially risky to get in there could be much much better price targets when maybe no one's talking about it or when there's so much negativity I learned the hard way and since I learned the hard way I understood maybe with corks maybe if people want to even buy this there could be potential better opportunities than December of 2013 or December 1st or December 2nd, right? So I'm not use, saying it as a buy or sell recommendation. These are just my thoughts on there are better times to get in and there are better times to get out. Now, the thing is, can people handle their emotions and make the right decisions? Those with experience, they will be able to for the most part. Those who are newbies, I was a newbie at one point, I would have gotten suckered in, but I did not get suckered in at this moment because I learned my lesson. So that's something to note, guys. So whenever you see the alternative media, mainstream media getting behind something aggressively, that may be the signal that, hey, 
there could be a better time to get in. Could, I could be wrong on some assets, but for the most part, that's the lesson that I've learned. What do you guys think? Leave me your thoughts below. I'll talk to you later. Bye.